Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the iPad Mini and the iPad Mini Smart Cover. On the right I have the 16GB black version and on the left I have the iPad Mini Smart Cover in red. Now I am cheating just a little bit here, I've already opened the product but I put everything back for the video. I'm just going to take the cover off and here we see the iPad Mini itself. I'm going to move that out of the way for a second so we can see what else is in the box. Underneath the little instruction booklets we have the new lightning port connector. And we also have a UK 3 pin plug. In the little packet we have here we have uh, the little iPad booklet. No, it's just one page. A little iPad info and Apple stickers. Bring the iPad Mini back in here and remove it from its packaging. And here it is. You can see I've already got some fingerprints on it. And if I turn it on, you can see I've already started downloading apps and customizing it. it feels very responsive. Rotation's quick. On the front here we have a uh, camera for FaceTime. Home button. On the right hand side we have a volume rocker switch and a uh, orientation or mute. On the top we have a power button, a microphone and a 3.5mm headphone jack. Nothing on the left hand side. And on the bottom, if I can get it in focus here, there we go have the new lightning co connector and stereo speakers. And on the back we have a 5 megapixel camera with no flash. I'm just having a look at the screen here and I know that it's not as high resolution as the retina displays but it doesn't look half bad from what I've seen so far. And now I'm going to have a look at the iPad Mini Smart Cover. As I said before I went for the red version because that's the nicest colour that Curry's had in stock. Didn't really want to go for a light grey version. There were some reports of scratches on the larger version due to the metal hinge, so on the smaller version Apple have decided to go with a full length fabric strip. Now just bring the cover close to the edge of the iPad and it should snap in place like so. And if I lift the edge it should wake the iPad and bring it back down, I'll put it back to sleep. And we can see here the configurations, a shallow slope for typing and a stand for watching movies or for a photo frame. It's not the sturdiest thing in the world, but it is still very handy. And that's my unboxing and first look at the iPad Mini.